In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a sticky floating video on any WordPress page or post that when a user scrolls down, will instantly float and stick to the side of the screen. Let me show you how I did that. So we're going to use a tool called Thrive Architect. If you're familiar with this channel, you'll know that I think Thrive Architect is uh, the best page builder out there for WordPress for many different reasons. The main reason is that all of the options are truly what you see is what you get. So using Thrive Architect, and you'll find a link down below uh, where you can pick that up. It's really inexpensive for what you get. But using Thrive Architect, we can use the video element, which on the right-hand side here, there are lots of different elements that you can use, but the video element, when dragged onto a page or a post, allows you to embed a video from YouTube, Vimeo, Wistia, externally hosted video, which essentially is everything else, an uploaded video, or VooPlayer. Uh, but YouTube is probably the most common. So you paste in your YouTube link and you instantly have a beautiful and fully customizable uh, video embed that you can align left or right or do whatever you want with. Um, but one of the coolest new features in Thrive Architect is the ability with just a simple toggle of a button, make that video sticky float on scroll. So let's look at some of those options real quick. You have the ability to float that video to the bottom right or the bottom left or the top right or the top left or keep the original position of the video. That's pretty great. You also have the ability to set the size of the video when it floats. So if you want it to be 400 pixels or 300 or 500, you can choose how big or small you want that video to be. And you also have the ability to edit the padding on the bottom right, bottom left, top, etc. It basically, the best way to think of that is how much you want to offset that video from the edge or the edges of the screen. You also have the ability to float that video on particular devices. Um, by default, it enables PC and tablet uh, and leaves mobile off. I highly recommend you either go with these settings or just float on PC. The reason you don't want to float on a mobile device is because that video will end up blocking the screen. And you also have the ability to add a close icon, which is a little X in the upper right hand corner that will appear so that people can close that video. That's a great user experience. Um, and the last option here that we have is floating in preview. Let me show you what that looks like. It's just a way to test and see what it looks like without having to uh, actually go preview the page. So let's look at a couple of things. As I scroll down, that video shoots over to the bottom right per my settings. You'll notice I do have the close button right here. You'll notice that it is offset about 25 pixels from the edge of the screen and it is in the bottom right. Now, if I go to mobile preview, which is a great feature of Thrive Architect, one-click button mobile preview. Notice as I pass this video, what happens? It's not at all floating on a mobile device. But if I enable it to float on a mobile device and I scroll past this video, notice how now it's obstructing the view of the text. Don't get me wrong, it looks pretty good for what it is. It's literally a YouTube video that's going to follow the user as they scroll down and it still gives them the close button, but I think it's blocking and taking up too much of the real estate on the page, particularly if your site is set where the navigation will appear as you scroll back up. Uh, so that's really all there is to embedding a video and having it float and follow the user as they scroll down on any page or post. You just simply use Thrive Architect as your page builder. If you have any questions about Thrive Architect, how to get it set up and running on your WordPress website, definitely check out other posts that I have here on convology.com as well as on this YouTube channel. I think that Thrive Architect uh, is hands down the fastest and most effective and efficient tool for building pages and posts in WordPress.